Okay, now we're back to the game. It's been a little while, but I thought I might try this game out again because I haven't finished it and I've heard it's not actually that long. It was a long wait because I was like doing university work. It's all sorted now, lots of things to arrange at home. And frankly, it's kind of a long game to sit down and play. But we're back. Now, need a little bit of catching up. If, uh, not that there's much to catch up on, really, because it's been quite a long while, although I do remember what the game is main quest is, I'm supposed to basically, uh, you know, go to these different realms and, uh, investigate the voices of Narat, evidence of their betrayal, um, you know, just expose both of the groups to see if they're actually working against Tunon. Officially, that's my objective. And I've also got to reactivate these towers. I think this is the, yeah, investigate the spies of stowing visions. And then that which remains. They haven't asked for these artifacts now. Broken are looking for me, help you into the Sentinel Stand Keep. So, I've got lots of places to go to, lots of spies to activate. Um, lots of places to go to, lots of spies to activate. And I've got to investigate the corruption of the disfavored and the voices of the rat. Right yes. now. I believe there's not much to, to talk about. Oh. You have something which requires my attention? What can I do for you? We'll talk later. Let's get on with the main quest for a bit, because it's been a little while, I believe. Yep, that'll be me. Verse. So we've got healer, tank, damage, and me, who's kind of a rounder. The question is which... Uh, bleh, not that. Which quest to go for first? I think. Hmm. Obviously, you can't really do the Trial of Archons because that's an overlapping quest, and there's Levian's Crossing. Think as well, Levian's Crossing Settlement. I believe that's where I was heading. Levian's Crossing is a growing trade settlement, blah 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 blah. Aha, the forge bound. Okay, yes, this is where I was heading. Because iron is a rare resource because we're in a very early age of medieval history. Uh, wrong map. Yeah, there we go. And it does take time to travel everywhere. If I'm not mistaken, I need to go to... Not the Bastard City. God, where was I going? Yep, it's been a while. It's not, frankly, not that surprising. I'm a bit confused. I believe these areas are locked off because of what I've done, or it's unlocked until, locked until later. There we go. Hang about, where am I going? This quest doesn't, uh, is it? It's not marked, is it? Should be marked. Travel to the Rust Canyons and meet with Theodore. Help the Despair take control of the Unbroken Camp. Okay. Maybe we'll get some anim events. That would be nice. Nope. All the way here. Okay, so the Rust Canyons, I believe, were a source where there was like a tornado. Yeah, it was a storm. The uh, Edict of Blades was used because the place was taking too long to capture. That's actually where Barrack's armor got devastated and he got turned into the creature he is today. The, Bar uh, the Edict of Blades is where you can see all the armor and stuff. And it's basically borderline impossible as far as I can understand. Hard to get through. Yeah. Hello. A resolute blade. An unbroken soldier struggles to rise on his feet. Okay, interesting. One arrow lodged in his shoulder, the other in his thigh. He attempts to stand, but his muscles are too weak. You're a white soldier? 
Chen Xiu in bafflement, squinting around the dust strewn expanse, recognition barely evident in his gaze. You ironclads don't usually ask questions before you start shoving spears in our guts. He hacks up a wad of bloody phlegm. Surprised you can even string words together. Before you can continue, you both catch the sound of iron boots. This would presumably be the disfavored. Yep, they are. A disfavored soldier calmly approaches from the west, regarding the vulnerable southerner with a curled lip and a disapproving shake of his head. Weak and broken. Prisoners make for poor sport. Your escape is spirited, but damned foolish. He raises his sword and points it at the unbroken man's heart, poised to let it plunge and impale him to the filth strewn ground. Is this really necessary? You've gained fear with it, didn't like that. His sword wavers as he notices you. Ah, Faith Binder. I hope you've come to tidy up the mess these vermin cause for us. But to answer your question, Ash has deemed it so, so yes, it is. In one swift motion, he plunges his sword into the man's heart, pinning the fallen soldier to the rusted earth. The disfavored soldier turns to the unbroken camp, frustrated, frustration evident in his tone. Then his gaze shifts over to you and back to the walls. I have reinforcements now, Elia. If you open the gates, I can still make this easy on you. He passes you a knowing glance, suggesting he's lying and proud of it. So presumably this is the unbroken camp. You see a woman striding purposefully into view atop a platform along the wall's edge. She lifts a spear and hurls it at Te I really can't pronounce his name, Theodore, because it keeps making me think of Theodore from Alvin and the Chipmunks. Theodore. Theodore. Whatever. Cursing under her breath when it breaks against the rocks. Missed. I'm so fucking tired of listening to you. Go shriek at someone else's fortress for a change and stop trying to impress me by hunting down unarmed prisoners. Maybe the ladies of the north get shivery over your bravado, but all it tells me is that your codpiece is emptier than your skull. I don't believe you've been introduced. No shit. One ironclad or two. It makes no difference. These walls can stand against Kairos' fury and your pig countryman sa countryman saber rattling. Make no mistake, Ilya. You'll be better served as my camp of charming than as my enemy. Such a waste of good potential. He tips his head to the west. Fatebinder, let's consult when you have a moment. Okay. So what is this? Some fucking one-man siege? Is that what he's doing? <laughs> That's the stealth button. I want... Yeah, tab highlights. Excellent. Oh. Maybe I would like that. Well, they're about the same, so why not? I don't believe anyone here uses a ranged weapon, but you can have that for now. It's a little bit more befitting of my class to wear that instead of a bandit's mask. Hmm. Rogue's leathers. Yeah, I do use tend to use light armor. Reducing my recovery and deflection is not great, although the armor is beneficial. Opportunist, though. I like opportunist. Nah, can I get away with looting these people? Crap. So where the hell did he go? He just waddled off. Dumbass. There's only so many places you could go. Okay, so here's the uh, unbroken camp. That's kind of pathetic, but okay. The lieutenant holds up a sword and squints through the obscurity of the high winds. Who goes there? Oh, it's you, Fatebinder. I wish you didn't have to witness that crude exchange before. Ellie and her lot have caused me no lack of trouble. You are most welcome here, even if your loyalties fall with the court more than the Legion. We need all the help we can get. They like me well enough. I'll never forget how you gave the chorus a piece of your mind to keep the stalwart locals from offing themselves. He shakes his head. I've always said the howling mob is better at scaring folks than recruiting them. Has sent word to expect to. If he dispatched an outsider to help us in the field, that says something about his urgency to see those unbroken conquered for good. 
I think we can both appreciate that his interest in seeing the ma this matter resolved is of a personal nature. I <clears throat> apologize for that outsider remark. Some of us aren't accustomed to working with anyone but the Legion proper. Let's focus on the task at hand. I, I'll be happy to leave this place in my tracks. Something about the wind seems to carry all of the words of the snake and refuse to this to refuse to this corner of Starwalt. As says the unbroken are scavenging the blade grave for an old Starwalt heirloom, I can think of nothing else that would help us breach Sentinel Stand short of the region's timely death. And are not making it easy by holding themselves up behind walls. If this conquest is any is any evidence, Starwalt folk are less inclined towards facing their enemies in an open battle. And Barak is is not voiced this time, which is I always find a bit annoying. Like, you know, have them all voiced or not at all. Like, I don't mind reading some of the dialogue, but I do wish the companions had full voicing. It is what it is, though. The tearsmen are like rats, squeezing themselves behind the narrowest walls to avoid the inevitable. Well, no matter what, what they find here, the unbroken are trapped. North of camp, we have soldiers led by my subordinate, Jacomus. To the south, reinforcements march as we speak. Hmm... So they would appreciate any help you could offer. The sooner we claim that unbroken artifact, the sooner we reach Sentinel Stand. Yeah, the unbroken were basically one of the only forces to really push off uh, Tunon's forces because, you know, they were one of the only disciplined legions in the area and they held the fortress for so long that the Edict of Storms gets called down to blast this, basically sandblast the entire area. Barely a 20th of the Unbroken's former strength survived to continue the war. Why is this territory even worth defending or taking? Well, the search for artifacts certainly changed how we view this garbage pit. In truth, Rust Canyons prevents us with some, presents us with some strategic advantages. Our location brushes shoulders with Iron Hearth and our Squatch Fort. If we could claim the spot for the disfavored, that would be as good as controlling the whole region. Kind of. Sentinel Stand is still the real prize. And any word from them? There seems to be more of a scout presence outside the wind wall. With the wind wall presumably, bleh, presumably being the edict still going. Unbroken, disfavored, everyone is on edge, waiting for something to happen. We'll have to hold our breath a little longer before we can uncork the old keep. Once we track down the Starbot artifact, it'll be a mad scramble as everyone races to claim Sentinel Stand first. But any new information, not as such. We have every reason to assume that Stradus Eridan hasn't committed suicide yet, and we're hopeful that Ash's daughter is in fair condition. I only hope her father's protection is keeping her spirits high. Well, we know why the Unbroken are here, so let's see how I can contribute. My men are eager for battle. I wouldn't mind taking the Unbroken camp in advance of our reinforcements, eh, boys? That'll show the old 15th cohort. You may want to clear out a group of unbroken by the bridge to the southeast. They guard another entrance into the camp. Some of our men are being held captive there too, and we need the extra numbers. Now, strictly speaking, my orders are to wait for reinforcements, so I can't directly assist you. But once we secure the camp, you'll get the first pick of spoils, and a chance to interrogate their leader. Very well. I need to think about this. Let's talk to the other leader. And farewell to you. May your dealings with the unbroken be most glorious for you. Most painful for them. Now, will they just. Over there? Can't go along with a healing potion. Prisoners within are dressed in unbroken colors. I would hope so. Well, let's see if we can parlay with who's outside. And what do we have here? The unbroken captain looks down from an elevator platform, resting a heavy boot on top of an axe head buried in wooden slats. She grips his handle as you approach. The storm caller, if I'm not mistaken. Elliot frowns down at you. You fucked us over good with that edict of storms. Oh shit, I forgot I was the one who did this one. Well, you gave us fair warning beforehand. I'll give you that much by way of respect. Aren't you the one who fucked over Agathon at Duskwatch? You have nothing to say to one another. Either you're Graven Ash's favourite comfort soldier, or you just see, like to see honest folk die. Either way, you're a pile of beast shit. No matter what happens here, the Unbroken will take back Sentinel's stand and banish all your northern piss troughs from the tears. 
I'd rather die than see Starwatt under Kairos' sigil. Oh, my bad. Tunon is the adjudicator. Kairos is the leader. Again, been a while. You can't imagine what I'd, have, what I'd do to avoid it. Do you truly believe you can win? Can I win? Probably not. Can Stalwart? Absolutely. Our people will remember... Yeah. I may die today and Stalwart may remain a wasteland for another generation. But our people will remember. That memory will waken a thirst only quenched by your overlord's blood. That hope is enough to keep me standing in defiance. Let's see. The unbroken to stand in defiance of Kairos' rule. My presence should be no surprise. Of course I expect the cast to dispatch someone eventually. The Overlord isn't in the habit of making appearances. He seems smart enough to realize the Overlord's wealth kills servants and foe alike. Why you aren't smart enough to do anything about it is a mystery to me. Have you found any artifacts? Yeah, your mother's piz- Charming. If you tell me how to breach Sentinel Stand, I might show the Unbroken Mercy. You'll pardon the fuck out of me if I go ahead and ignore your northern rhetoric. Your type sees us nothing but future slaves. This one's got a smart mouth. I like her. Think she'd be interested in joining us? I don't suppose you would. Are you fucking kidding me? I'd rather gargle beast milk. <laughs> well, a girl can't get everything she wants. What's important is you tried your best. I already know that it's favored are looking for artifacts of stalwart. Already know they're searching blind. I'll take my knowledge to the grave if it keeps you out of Sentinel Stand. You can count on that. Much as I love to put Nara through her foot, she's got a point. We should return with Theodora and his ironclads at his back. Major choice. Well, the important thing is I tried. Now, who are you? I talk to you. Fold your sail, stranger. This bridge marks the beginning of unbroken territory. He scrapes his blade on the planks in front of him, drawing a line. Carlos's force has already tried to best us. They got this far. I know you for what you are, Northerner. I never met a woman or man from Carlos's domain who didn't try to invite my countrymen into the fold. I'll give you this chance to leave. Otherwise, I'm prepared to give my life defending this bridge. Meager though it may seem. That's fucked up. How long have you been fighting Chaos's forces? Long enough to have sons twice at least. Holy crap. After the storm, I thought Chaos would be satisfied with our pain. The Overlord still finds reason to kick us. Let's pass the bridge. Nothing likes of you would be interested in. Fair enough. Farewell. I may have committed down the path of... Retribution. It's my fault for being too much of a centrist. I should have been more willing to help the resistance and less, less trying to yeah, mediate between all the forces. Still, I was just doing my job. I will help you take the unbroken camp. Glad to, glad to hear it. I will go off to the unbroken station at the eastern bridge first. You motherfucker! Fine. Back we go. Only have primary quests at the moment. Fine by me. Oh my god, the overlay still says Bloodborne. Give me one second. Let's see. Tools. I believe there's a... Now, where did I put my Twitch settings? Nope, not that. Excuse me for just a second. Yeah. Shouldn't be too hard to fix this. 
most certainly not playing Bloodborne at this current moment. I thought I had the mobile live dashboard set up. Yeah, request an SM. Oh, there we go. Yeah, let's just get this fixed and out of the way. Won't be the last time I'm streaming it, this game, I'm sure. God, who could possibly be watching? It's not Bloodborne in the category. It's not Bloodborne either. It's Tyranny. There we go. And that's all fixed. I believe there was a way to speed up time. Maybe mistaken. Oh well. Well, I guess you all have to die. Another fool will come to test us, he shouts to his men. Once we catch the northerner, stake him up at the wind wall. Well, you may be surprised. Their party is on. Excellent. It's not going to do me any good. Damn it, Barrack, you got in the middle of our attack. Now I have to switch moves. Elf's fine. If I move, let me move here. And pause. Perfect. Bridge is a terrible choke point, and Barrack is not helping. Not much of a fight. Feel kind of bad. It really wasn't much of a fight at all. Oh, a Skyblade Javelin? That might be good for me. <laughs> so I have a Sun Soldier... I have a Sun Soldier's Javelin. And they are literally the same weapon. But it's valuable, so I'll take it. Broken Shield is less valuable. Oh wait. Bunch back up together. Crap. If I'm not mistaken, there we go. Battered Helm. The helm has been destroyed by the constant battle of dust and sand, but under the grime and dents, you can see it is of exceedingly high quality. A master blacksmith had a spire forge upgrade. And perfect. Bonk! The eastern side of the camp, like he asked, there should be prisoners somewhere. 
Uh, let's see. Let's see how we're going to handle this. Okay, one move here. No, wait, no, not that guy. God damn it. Oh, sundered. Bad. the game harder. What difficulty is this on? Oh god, it's one of those. Yeah, I'm just on normal. That explains it. Probably should have put it on hard. There we go, Jesus. Let's get through that armor. Why didn't you just use this ability, goddammit? There we go. Better. Food. Not sure I really need all this crap to be honest, but. Aha! Give me that. Maybe I shouldn't do that. Maybe Lantry should do it. Sigil of Distant Impact. Ooh, neat. Not yet, though. Don't need that. Form up first. There we go. Trouble is afoot. Ah! <laughs> ha, perfect.
got a shield. Oh, hello. Better armor penetration, half a second more recovery, less accuracy. Yeah, I'll take it. The bronze tower shield. Hmm. That might be good for Barrack. Yeah, it's good for Barrack. Can you reach that winch over there, or should I take aim? You learn something every day. Ellie is back there, I can probably get my way to those uh, disfavored prisoners. Your days okay. This should be a good old fashioned. on health. Yeah, target them. Perfect. Let's cripple them. Hopefully if I can actually get around to them. Come on. Thank you. I don't know why. That's just bad perfect. Perfect. Already down. Now it's time for quicken. Armor might be too heavy. And I can't get through! Should be easy enough to finish off. Oh, look at that. Terrible. I was wondering, I was like, wait, don't already have that? Oh, hello. Might have a gander at that one. Yeah, that'll do. Uh, my cat is such a nice person. I can actually stand to go out, frankly, and then uh, come back through.
Ah, max number of camping supplies, that's why. I mean, let's have at him. Fuck that mess. Most of it off now is a tool for punishing unruly soldiers as a source of leverage. Oh, it's metal, that's why. Yeah, you hold on to it. Alright, now let's get out through the front door. I also got a level up here. Attribute points. Hmm. Yeah, more accuracy would be good. And then I've got a talent point, so let's see. Model will increase damage of film weapons and other basic attacks, destroy multiple times. Third, greatly increased damage. Okay. Trying to look at the actor versus the uh... Ah, add a rooting first to the first ability. Now first now also increases movement speed and breaks current engagements. Interesting. Just gotta remember where else I have points. Nope, it's all in range, interesting. Not a bow user, so these are javelins I'm using. I have six points, so I can't get any of these three. Ricochet, grazes and misses with range attacks, bounce their enemies behind their target. Interesting. Let's get the Throne Mastery first. That's just an objective upgrade. So let's get that. Then you, let's see, Gifted Healer, Modern Improves Control, Greatly Improves, blah, blah, blah. Let's get the third level. Magic boy. Easy enough to pick that option. Now it's easy enough to just make a way out. It seems like we have quest givers. I mean, we might actually be finished already. I guess we walked off a little bit too eagerly. Try and tackle the fort itself, the motley scavengers are as protected as we have to find them, okay. And one. Need some castle fine, maybe a few teeth, blah blah blah. Shouldn't want you have to trade, I guess. Oh, actually this is perfect. I do, I do need this. He's a crap. Let's get rid of all this crap.
14 gold and like what can I actually get from them is back I suppose is the important thing. Not much actually. Blood chanted levers would be about just as good. Not much here at all. What is this heart finder? Is that a javelin? Accurate? Okay, hold on. Interesting. So this is recovery 3.7 seconds total, and it's accurate. Very accurate. She has a whole second off, but the armor penetration is not great. Eh. Just sell everything we're not using at the moment. Everyone else seems pretty much fine. Although, yeah. Yeah. Give me that money. Perfect. Okay, so did I just come back here for no reason? It seems like there's pretty much nothing worth doing here. I mean, it was worth to sell the gear, I suppose. Yep, I guess I'm massacring the fort. It is what it is. I was under the impression there were prisoners here, though. Caught the winch down. Easy enough to punch through. Motherless swine fucker! When I'm done with you, the flies won't have a spot on spot to land on your wretched eye. Isn't she the best? I wish we could keep her, but she doesn't seem the type to be taken alive. You're only making this harder on yourself, Elia. Actually, I'm making it harder on you. Piss off and tell your overlord to shove it. It's fair enough, really. Cutting you off from the unbroken captain. I mean, that fucker wasn't helping me anyway. Oh wait, the unbroken, <laughs> the disfavored. Well, I mean, it should be easy enough to take. Let's get you aggroed. Wait, no, let's see where they go first. I can get all three of them, I think. Ah, just one. Let's find that. to loot. Fuck. I guess the disfavored are taking over. The lieutenant serves, surveys the unbroken encampment with a dignified air. Nicely done. Nicely done. I didn't think you'd stand a chance without our help, but you're tougher than you look. It would seem that Elia fled due north, which means she's taken the real prize with her, the Star Wars artifact. Or knowledge of it. Her fighting force might just be enough to punch through Jacomus and his men. We should chase her down before she has a chance. Hmm. During the initial attack, several unbroken were also spotted fleeing north of camp. If you find them, be sure to put them down. Interesting. No, I'm not like that. Farewell. 
God, I thought I accidentally clicked it for a second. All together now. Okay. Grab the gear. Crap. Crap. I mean, I guess you couldn't use that. I think, yep, that was an heavy loot. So we're fine. Not much left. Ouch! Await my... I've got it. Junkyard. Okay, that's a fast travel point now. Oh no, it's a... Marker. a little winding way over here. Oh, hello. What the hell was back here? Let's go do that before we uh, interact with this. There's definitely something back here worth looking at. a lot of combat which uh, I mean I probably should actually put it onto hard because I've just not had to use many of my abilities all the party AI is just really good it has that um you know like not turn-based but sort of turn-based like compromise quality which I've never been a big fan of You're all that's left do 
Don't need that. Could use that. Presumably we got some medium. Yeah, perfect. The equipment of both the Savid and Unbroken Soldiers are better than the Jagged Rocks. The destruction of Chaos's edict did not distinguish ally from enemy. Alright, let's get over there. Ah, so that's what I can use the pole for. But I can move it. Oh, hello. Who are y'all? Hold! The soldiers, weary, the soldiers, weary from lack of nourishment, scramble to draw weapons and snap to attention. The apparent leader sets forward to address you. I don't recognize you. Wait, why can I only attack them? What the fuck? I didn't want to do that. Let's uh, reload. Why do I only have the choice to attack them? I mean, at that point, I might as well just not even come over here. <laughs> oh shit, did I reload a save that's very too early? I hope not. Fuck. What, there's no autosave? What? Oh, Jesus. Yes. Oh, I guess that's the end of this stay stream.